We are back here with Ukulele in the Impossible Lair, ready to take on the rerouted version of Chapter 10, Rope Burn Ridge. And I have no clue how they're going to implement this, rerouted. The only stage where we took an entirely different route was Chapter 7, where we just went backwards. That was when we were running away from a gigantic freaking laser beam. Oh god. Ah! Look! The ropes are swinging all over the place. What? Weren't they doing that before? Already? Or nah? Were they still before? I don't know. Why do we have a floating box? Strange. Okay. Oh, it's, it was balancing on that. I see it. Okay. Interesting. Nice. Okay. Good amount of coils to start out. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah, okay, there's water there. I didn't see the water. And, oh, I was about to skip right past that. Why is that thing... It looks like it's like electrocuted, right? Oh, come on now. <laughs> uh, I like how it takes so long to lower. Oh god, there's a crab! Should we, uh... Boom. Get out of here. Ah. There we go. Ooh. That was good stuff. Okay, there's something up here, I don't think. These guys, yeah, they're gonna move over. Oh, another crab. We probably skip this guy entirely, right? Yeah. Oh, ah, ah! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Come here. Fine, asshole. Sweet. Oh, come on, bro. Come on. Come down, come down, come down, come down. <sighs> Just poorly estimating my jump height. That's all it is. Come on. Up we go. All right, I'll wait extra long this time. All right, how about that? on that guy. Um, oh god. Oh, there's a coin thing up there. Ooh, okay. Sweet. Yes. Nice. Alright. Lock that guy in. I'm enjoying this so far. I, I, I do like the rope mechanic. It's like a very freeing feeling, you know? Oh, you have to time that sucker exactly. Ooh, nice. Alright. Okay, so we only have two coins so far. Didn't even see that freaking thing. 
Didn't even see the little the lone quill by itself. I think that's the first time one of those uh, jump off the enemy puzzles has worked out in my favor. Usually it's fucking frustrating as hell. Takes me like eight attempts to do. slow cruise all the way across oh god oh shit okay we got the save point that's all that matters right and Lily's fucking out of here all right yeah so we're at three twits right now I feel like am I crazy to think that there was something there kind of feels like there's something there right am I tripping Oh god, oh, woo -hoo. snap, crackle, pop, okay. I was actually kind of like, not sure. I was like, ah. Oh god. I like being able to chain the Laylee jumps. It's like, alright, let's get Laylee back, and then I'll fall into that hit. And I'll be able to get right out of it. Okay, how do we get past this guy? Wow, okay. I didn't think I missed that. Alright, we got the fourth coin. Yeah, it's locked in. What? What? No way. Unbelievable. <laughs> wow. Ah, oh, man. These hitboxes are wild. Okay, I guess with this enemy right here, I can't be on the chain. I have to, like, be in my jump animation, I guess is the point. Actually, be landing a hit. All right, let's try this again. So no, oh come on, come on, brother, come on, brother. All right, there's a Lily Bell right there. Ooh, skin of our teeth. Oh, okay, I, I guess it doesn't just drop me off the rope and I lose the invincibility frames. Okay, fair enough. Okay, no losing Lily on dumb bullshit. Just kidding. There will, there will be plenty of losing Lily on dumb bullshit while I'm playing this game. Back in business. Oh my god. Oh! <sighs> this is bad, man. I've already reached the pity? I didn't think I was doing that badly. Unbelievable. Okay, let's just. Oh. <laughs> man, oh man. Okay. Why does that keep happening? I don't know why it just doesn't let me fall. Like, why do I re-grab the rope and then lose my invincibility? I don't know. It's all strange. Oh my god. Man, his tail is like bigger than the, than the graphic is showing, you know? How? How? Okay, who the fuck cares? Here. Locking it in. Okay, I don't know how I'm supposed to get that without... Uh... Yeah, that's a narrow ass... 
Yeah, that's really narrow to try and get that quill and then try to twirl back to safety. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Move, sir. I thought there was something, something there. Kind of looked like there was something there, no? Okay. Sloppy. It's like once I lose Laylee, I'm always like worrying about that, you know? Like worrying about, okay, now I gotta play defensively, now I can't get hit. Ah. Bad. There we go. Is there anything up here? No? Over here. Ooh. Who needs who needs Laylee? Just kidding. Missy girl. Cool. That was a good level. I really enjoyed that one. I enjoy all the rope stuff and the And the, you know, when you grab a thing and it raises up, those are all pretty fun mechanics to play with. So now that should complete, we'll check on this in just a second, but that should complete pretty much all of the levels and their alternate forms up to what we've played through so far, which is chapter 15, including chapter 15. So now we can go all the way back through to that lake area go from there. I see chapter 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and now we can go to the Queasy Quay. Let us head over there right now. We'll have to, um, I wish we could just fall out here. Oh, we can. Nice. We don't have to go through all the little tunnel maze areas. We'll be back for you, Trouser, because that's the uh, that's the access point to the the final area up top right here. We can go through here and then from I think yeah here that'll put us in the lake, and then we can make our way to the to the beach. What am I hitting? Oh, I'm hitting <laughs> I'm hitting the stair. It looked like a, a downward stare to me. Kind of hard to tell from that perspective. Okay. And there was actually one, one thing we can do over here. We can activate... Um, there's a pagey sitting there that we can activate. Uh, and we should be able to get a... A bomb from over here and that'll open up this area so we can access it like even more easily mm. so it should be the last I think this is the last page or we haven't done the top area yet so this is one of the last pages oh whoa new enemy alert we gotta get the bomb, and we gotta do... Oh, we gotta kill these guys. Okay. What? <laughs> oh, there's the ropes. I didn't even see the freaking ropes. Um, okay. 
Oh, I have to go down here now. I see it. Oh god, ah! Alright, cool. That should be a cakewalk. We'll let it get a little closer. I don't know how, the, how far the bomb can travel before it kind of drops off. Right, that should be good. Yep, easy. Easy stuff. <laughs> I didn't even see the ropes. I was just doing like a blind jump across. I'm like, how do I get there? Do I have to like take a hit on the, the thorns and then jump across again? That was silly. All right, Pagey. Open the open the moat. Not the moat. Open the wall. Mm. Easy access. That's what I'm talking about. Alrighty. Oh, and we can also uh, complete our destruction of this wonderful shopping cart community by destroying the last last house here. For some quills. Oh, and there's a guy here. What do you want? Um, search for a suspicious streak of submerged sea stones. They aim at the secret you're looking for. They aim at it. Okay. So we want to see some submerged stones. Let's see if we can see any stones. There's some, I mean, not, not stones, they're just like starfishes and stuff like that. Okay. I don't think I solved this, this brother's hint either. I think I bought it. I don't think I solved it though. Buried treasure. An open area with not much around. How do you retrieve it? Off the scratcher map. Okay. So here are some more stones. They're not... There's shells, I guess, is a more apt descriptor. What was here? Was there anything here? Was there a chest here? Who knows? Okay. Here are the st here's the stones. They point. I mean, there's a shitload of stones here. I don't know. Uh. Okay, so we gotta find this thing of stones in open area without much going on. It's kind of an open area right here. We'll have to... Um, we'll have to scratch our map. I guess. I don't know how to scratch the map. We just literally do this. It seems kind of silly. I like how there's like two shadows of me. Like there's like the one circular thing and then the one that's my actually my shadow okay there's there's a tonic right there okay so we can't really activate using a ground pound you think the only other way is to drain the entire freaking thing because there's not much we can do underwater That is troubling. So we have stones that are supposed to point us towards the correct way. We have a straight up tonic right there. Life's a beach. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. No real open areas here. Hmm, I'm not sure. I only. <laughs> The only solution, which has kind of been a catch-all solution so far, is what if we throw a fucking bomb at the thing? Oh, I can't. Okay. Well, all right. <laughs> we'll figure that out another day. Do you have anything to say for yourself? And oh, no, I already destroyed your house. I'm happy to tell you the market has just opened up. A lot of real estate. But you might not have previously thought. Okay. Next time we'll pick it up right here with more impossible lair.